What's up guys? It's Ben with VW Family Farms and today I was going to present you with a little trick that we learned from a uh, fellow YouTuber and it has turned out to be amazing. Do y'all have that problem right there? Come out and look at your tomato plant and half of the leaves are stripped off of it. The dreaded tomato worm. The trick we found to this, found it from uh, Jess over at Roots and Refuge. Uh, they, they had a video here a while back that showed them outside with a black light at night. So I thought, hmm, I'm gonna put that to the test. And lo and behold, we ordered one, got it in. This little dude is amazing. We have found bukus of tomato worms. Here's a little short clip of us out at night and how easy it is to see these things glowing with this black light. Here goes. All right. We are trying an experiment that we saw on a YouTube video that we really like to watch, Roots and Refuge. Jess and them, oh, Whoa! no, that's not one. Oh. <laughs> Jess and them got a black light and found tomato hornworms. So I just ordered us one and we were fixing to see. Is that one? I see hey, one. That's a bird. That? <laughs> nope, that was a bug. You might, Emily, you might try to get it back here. We can shine more on the whole plant. <gasps> There's one! Where? It's a big one. Where? Y'all see it? It's on the underside. It's on the underside. Oh. Well, no, let me get it on camera because I can't. Look how that thing glows. Alright. Pick it off and put Lane it in the bucket. Lane needed it. It has a spike on it. Lane's got to do it because it's got a spike. We can just pick it off like this. Look. Boom. There's a thing in there. Whoa. So well, that's a baby. There's no more. That one. Where? Oh, I see. It's right there. Is that oh, one? Let me get a camera on it. He's moving. He's moving around. Let me get the camera on it. I'm trying to look. Glow bug. He's broken. <sighs> There's one. Oh wow. He's a big one, dude. It'd be nice if you could use them as a catfish bait. Yeah. Like those worms you get off that kind of tree, whatever this is called. Yeah, they peek on you. Peek on you. Tapa? The top of worms? Yeah. There is. There's a big one. Whoa. Oh yeah. Thank you, Jess. On your video. And the information on where you There's got it. There's another one. Where? Yeah. This makes it so much easier than trying to find them in the daytime. This is fun. Grab that wormy. That's it. Just grab the worm. That's just one. That's one. Huh? So I just don't want to grab a horn. Oh, they are. not They won't hurt you. There we go. Oh, yeah. That's the other one. Grab that one. Yep. This thing is amazing. Here to let swing it. Rip it. Oh. Such a another one. <laughs> There's so many. <laughs> That's why okay. no leaves. You gonna zoom in on that? That's big as my thumb. <laughs> that dude is giant. Wait, um, oh my goodness, there was a. Daddy, go ahead, Lane. I don't really want to. Giant. Hey, yeah, yeah, buddy. Look at this. Grab the. Yeah. Oh. Look at the head. Bugs all in my face. Look in there. 
Okay, we're gonna catch so far. Those There's another one. No, the so cool. camera. The camera's not doing them no justice. No. This is awesome. Uh -huh. <coughs> Need help? No, I was just showing the camera. There's another one, I think. Yeah, yeah on the back side of the leaf. Yeah. On the back side of what? Right there. Up in a weird way. <coughs> there's there's one. One. Oh, there's one. Oh, wow. I knew it looked like somebody's legs was missing. A few moments later. It's on me! Hey. Alright, this right here. Hold this light, Emily. Mm. Don't touch it. Wow. What a guy told me go. today. Yeah, you can let it go. Did you kill it? Are you gonna kill it? That may not be it, but I thought. That's ginormous. Hold on, turn the camera a little bit so they can see it. It's creepy looking. Yeah, it's got a thing right here on the. Hold my camera, Emily. Got it? Guy, talk, neighbor I was talking to. It was eyes. So freaky. Sit. This thing right here. He said they look like a hummingbird. See that thing right there? How it oh yeah. Comes out there. It's cool. That's what lays the eggs that makes these hornworms. Hornworms. Hey, do All right, come on. We're gonna try something. Will those hornworms come on. turn into that? Yep. All right. Everybody knows what's in here. Can you see here? Tilapia, black hornworms. Oh, they keep floating out of that little lip. Any hey, kiddos? How many are we supposed to have? Four. Four. Two big ones, two small ones. There's the worm. They keep floating under the sides. I'm probably scared of the block. There's a... There's a... There's a... Here, see if we can get them up here. No, they're not coming? No. Well, here's the... Here's the big one. Oh, there's three of them there. <laughs> but this is the big one. So, this monster won't be getting any more tomatoes. So that's number... Six. Six. Oh, number seven's gonna fall. Well, let's make sure he goes in. Seven. Eight. Seven. Eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, no. Trying to chew on 13, the 14, thing. 15, 16, 17. That's how many we got off. Comment down below if you do this, how many you got off yours. Yeah, if you've done that, I'd like to know how big of a haul you've got. But if you had never done it, this is our first time to do it. Like I said, I want to thank Jess from Roots and Refuge. Showing this on her video, this was a quick, easy, painless way to do it. Hardest part about it, staying up after dark. So, anyway, another short little clip that a handy little tool can save you a lot of time. All right, guys, thanks for watching that little short video. I hope that uh, inspires you to maybe use a little less chemical, less pesticides and go get you a black light how fun and easy it it is to find them little boogers uh, throw them down step on them feed them to your tilapia feed them to your chickens uh, all kinds of ideas out there so anyway thought that might somebody might get a little 
useful help out of that and until next time thanks for watching and god bless